Psalm 139, verses 7 through 10. It says, Where shall I go from your spirit? Or where shall I f- flee from your presence? If I ascend to heaven, you are there. If I make my bed in Sheol, you are there. If I take the wings of the morning and dwell in the uttermost parts of the sea, even there your hand shall lead me, and your right hand shall hold me. God is everywhere all the time. There's nowhere that we can go and not be in His presence. Now that is either really scary or really comforting. In other words, that either brings fear to you and to me, or it should bring comfort to you and to me. It should bring fear if we think about the ways that we sin or that we struggle with sin. But in those moments when we are in so desperate need of refuge, in those moments when we're in when our confidence seems to be low because of our struggles and because of pain and because of difficulty, what do we find out? We find out that he's our he's our resting place. Jesus says, "Come to me, all who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest." So he it's it's we actually should fear him and rest in him. And so today, here's the question for you. For what reason do you have to fear God today, knowing that He's with you everywhere? But at the same time, because, because He is righteous, He is holy, He is all-powerful. But at the same time, what reason do you have to rest in Him? And our rest is only found in Him and through His Son, Jesus Christ. So today, whatever you're going through, let me let let you remember, you can rest in Him. But also remember this, as you face the, the temptations to sin today, remember He is worthy to be feared. Be sure your sin will find you out. He knows. Let me lead us in a word of prayer, okay? Father, I thank you for today. I praise you, Father, because you are so immense. You are so powerful. Our minds can't even fathom what it means that you are everywhere all the time, that we can't run away from your presence. We can't get away from your presence. Father, Forgive us for any sins. God, open our eyes to show us any sins that are in our life. And God, help us to be set free from those struggles. From fear. From anger and bitterness and words that we say. From addictions and struggles that we deal with. Lord, just from an unwillingness to show grace. But Father, also today, would you help us to remember that we can find comfort in you, Lord. We can find peace in you. And so, God, we entrust ourselves to you today. Thank you for my friends, my brothers, and my sisters, everybody who will watch this. I pray for you to give your care and minister to them right now. And we ask it in the powerful and the great name of your Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ, who suffered and died and rose again. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much for watching today. I pray this has been a blessing for you. Be sure to share it if indeed it's been a blessing and you think someone might be blessed by it. See you soon. Bye.